Hi all, welcome. Today I'm going to do a little review on these two bags that I recently brought with me on my summer vacation on the beach. Which one I prefer and which one I regret buying. Let's start with the name. It is the Loewe Small Basket Bag in palm leaf and calf skin this one is the smaller size and this one is the Prada Raffia tote bag in black it is the bigger size I think they have two size one in smaller size I'm gonna start with this Prada it is a big tote bag the dimension is around 40 cm in width, the height is around 34 cm, and the depth is around 16 cm. The material of this bag is wicker or straw according to Prada website. It is not soft at all. It rubs against my clothes and it ruins some of them. I will show you later. Other thing is, this one is a very heavy bag even though it is empty and when I fill this bag up with my things, it gets so heavy and it leaves marks on my arms, a deep marks, so most of the time my hubby carry this bag for me when we were on vacation recently. Now I will show you the inside. I will empty the bag from the stuffing first. Here is how the inside of the bag looks like. It is just one big compartment without any pocket. Just this Prada made in Italy tag in leather. It has two handles here. It's enough for me to use it as shoulder bag. The side here, the Prada triangle in enamel, it just looks like that. The bottom has no fit. I got this one from a reseller friend. We don't have any Prada beauty around. I didn't know this bag will be this heavy. It is really annoying for me. Um, I just hate every minute of using this one because of the heaviness and because of the material here as I mentioned before it is not a soft material at all it wraps again my clothes when I use it as a shoulder bag and it ruins some of them I will show you so here is one of the clothes that gets ruined by this bag it is a very airy and thin fabric I didn't realize when I use the bag as a shoulder bag it wraps against this part here and I found this ripped here because of the bag this is only one part of this clothes that gets ruined by the bag I found some other rips on other parts of this clothes also and my other thin clothes like this also has ribs on them and I just realized that after I got back from vacation that is because of this bag because those clothes I only wore with this bag there's something to let you know if you have bags with this material just careful with the clothes that you are wearing Thin clothes like this get ruins by the wicker or straw, whatever it's called. Also, I found some fraying on the body of the bag. I don't know if my camera can pick it up. It's minor but still fraying after one or two weeks of use. Not everyday use. I alternate between my other bags too when I went on vacation. That's all some of the things that 
I don't like about this bag and I want to share with you if you ever think about getting a bag like this maybe you could take my experience for some consideration for now this is the worst beach bag I have ever have now my best beach bag this year got to be this Loewe small basket bag in palm leaf and calf skin leather the dimension of this bag is around 33 centimeters in width the height is around 17 centimeters and the depth is around 13 centimeters according to the website I don't know how to measure this bag because of the shape but that's all I can share with you this is made from palm leaves and this is a handmade bag so I heard that every bag is not the same I mean not the same exact size it is a very light bag and also super convenient to use which I didn't expect when I first got this one because I I was skeptical that I spent that much money on a straw bag like this but honestly it is very convenient and I just fall in love with this bag I also find some fraying with this bag after few use but it doesn't matter this bag didn't ruin any of my clothes and I really enjoy using this one I will show you what I could carry inside this little one because this bag doesn't have any lining or anything inside and just a big compartment here I'm afraid that if I didn't use any type of liner inside my things will cut lost so I just happened to find this bag from Sara I think it is out of stock now but I got this one around April and I think it is perfect for the bag liner for this one also my long champ fillet too it looks pretty inside also keeps my things safer I have my wallet at the time my sunglasses and my toiletry so these things I keep inside to be safe so I don't lose them like this and I have my wet wipes sunblock hand cream and hand sanitizer on the outside here like this so easy access for me and that's it it is very convenient to use it looks pretty and it is super light for now I think it is safe to say that I do love this bag and I totally recommend this bag for a beach bag or for a summer bag so if you are looking for one this one is the one that's all guys for my review today if you are looking for a bigger tote this one can carry all your things but I do not recommend this particular bag because of the reason that I told you before so this is a no-no and this one is a yes I wish I got this in bigger size maybe I will looking for a bigger size in different brand for the bag like this I prefer the bag from palm leaves like this Loewe one okay hope this video helps and thank you so much for your time guys see you again soon Bye.